Hi, I'm Jane from Poppy Patchwork and welcome to my quilt block series. In each of these videos I'm going to show you how to make a different block and they're all going to measure 12 inches. I hope you like this video, if you do click the like button and please let me know in the comment section below what other videos you'd like me to make. Let's get quilting. Today I'm going to show you how to make this 12 inch block which I've called Guinevere. I was inspired by the Lady of the Lake block and so I've decided to call mine Guinevere. You're going to need two four and a half inch squares in background fabric and five one and a half inch by seven inch strips. You're going to need two four and a half inch squares in fabric A and four three and a half inch squares in fabric A. You'll also need four three and a half inch squares in fabric B and you will need four one and a half inch by seven inch strips in fabric C. Making the nine patch units. Lay out your strips into three sets. As you can see from the photo, one of those sets is laid out differently. Pin fabric C to the background fabric with right sides together. Sew with a quarter inch seam and then press the seams towards fabric C on all three sets. Pin the third strip set in each set to the sewn pair. And then sew with a quarter inch seam and again press towards fabric C. Then trim one end of the strip set. Cut the strip set into one and a half inch strips. Each strip can be cut into four sets. Repeat until you have 12 units. Rearrange into the nine patches. Pin and sew with a quarter inch seam matching the seams. Press the seams open. Pin and sew with a quarter inch seam, again matching the seams. And then press the seams open. This will give a flatter finish to the nine inch patches. Making the half square triangles. Use the four and a half inch squares in the background fabric and fabric A. Draw a line on the wrong side of the fabric across the diagonal. As shown in this photo. background fabric right sides together with fabric A. And sew a quarter inch seam on both sides of the drawn line. Then cut along the drawn line. as shown here in the photo. Trim 
trimming the half square triangles. Lay the 45 degree line on the ruler on top of the seam. And line up the bottom and left edges at just over three and a half inches. Trim the top and right edges. Turn the unit round and lay the 45 degree line along the seam. Line the bottom and left edges at exactly three and a half inches. Trim the right and top edges. Block layout. Press your units and lay in the block layout as shown. Pin pairs together and sew with a quarter inch seam. Return to the block layout and there's no need to press yet. Pin in columns as shown and sew with a quarter inch seam. Press the seams in opposite directions on the columns. As shown in the photo. Pin the columns together matching the seams and sew with a quarter inch seam. Return to the block layout. Again, no need to press yet. Pin matching seams and sew with a quarter inch seam. Return to the block layout. And press your seams open. Congratulations, you have made my Guinevere block. Want to learn more? Watch another one of my videos from the Quilt Block series. Click above to go to my playlist. I hope you liked this video. Please like and subscribe to my channel. More of these videos will be posted, so please tune in. Thank you for watching and bye for now.